beautiful Scorpios. Thank you for your patience. Um, I'm in the beautiful uh, Pacific Northwest in Olympia National Park in a tent. And so I had to get some Wi-Fi and get your reading up. I'm so excited. This is the second half of July for my Scorpio Collective. We only bring in the white light, bright light, pre-shuffle, soulmate. So it's going to be a soulmate reading. Yes, this is your soulmate. Or are you claiming it? And then under some advice, and we'll get one and shuffle and see what guides and angels pull out for you. But was my beloved, though we may be physically apart, spiritually, we are always united. For love transcends space and time. For love transcends space and time. Nothing is missing. Oh my God, my dear souls. So we're going to, and then playfulness, which is you, Scorpio. So thank you for letting me indulge you in that. Oh, welcome back. Thank you. Thank you for liking and subscribing because you are my divine chosen ones. You are the teacher that awakens and Mary Magdalene is here to bless your reading. You have something important to share. Follow the inner call. Don't let anything stop you. Rewind. Okay, so, 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 so true. And then as we get into the Gilded to see what is coming through for my collective Scorpio for the second half of July. Thank you, angels and guides, for joining me. Finally, I got a nice, cool breeze around my crown chakra. Oh, I lit the incense for my beautiful totem. I was born here in this town. Haven't been back in 59 years. Okay, 58 and a half. Isn't that crazy, guys? Just going to explore. As you explore Scorpio, the second half of July, we call in Mary Magdalene, Keepers of the Light. All of the Native American heritage, what is coming through? Justice. That is just pre your birthday. All right. The Libra equilibrium. I feel it's you. Like we were saying, you know, there's some something important to share the inner call. You see how she's blindfolded, yet it's justice. So you're weighing out the scales of a situation by following your intuition regarding a soulmate or a king of cups that hasn't come out to tell you how he feels. And you've been up at night worried about what is going to happen. You create your reality by following your intuition and listen to the call. Listen to the call. I just saw the Ten of Pentacles. What's coming forward for my Scorpios for the second half of July 2020? Spirit guides and angels, what do you have for my Scorpios? In love, we need truth and clarity. Truth and clarity. Ooh, some competition. And you're getting your strength back. Could be competition in work. Or in relationships that you're like, should I continue or should I move on? I'm looking to the horizon. I want justice in the situation. I don't want any more drama. I'm finding my strength. I'm not going to deal with players no more. Seven of swords reversed. Yeah, we're done with them coming and going. Mm -mm. Don't waste the pretty because love is on the horizon. The lovers. I read the cut. You guys know how it rolls. Spirit guides and angels. Who is this soulmate that we have to look forward to in the future and have strength? Knight of Pentacles. Someone coming in slowly and steady. And it's you as well. Having that strength and valor and honesty, integrity like a knight has. Yes, there's going to be competition in the field or you wouldn't be wearing the armor. But now, take a look around before you head on out to find that soulmate. Because the wheel's about to change. My Scorpios, yay. Wheel of Fortune keeps showing up. Which way are we? We're up. The star. Our wish is fulfilled. Claim it now, your soulmate. Through attraction, because when you are romantic love you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully Ooh, past life guys 
We knew it. When we meet them, we know it. You're Scorpios. I'm a Scorpio. When we meet them, we are more interested in how we feel about the situation, but we're also kind and generous. And we're getting out of our own way. No more self-sabotage. What about this soulmate coming in? Spirit guides and angels, what are your messages for Scorpio for the second half to break through and have the strength and clarity? What do we need to know? The moon. Yeah, we want to know. We want to know the secrets. How are they? How is it turning? We look online. We spy on other people. We're keeping our eye out maybe for someone new that Knight of Cups that will come in with a little bit more vigor and passion. Is that what you want? Let's claim it. Yeah. <laughs> Two of Cups. Let's claim it. Yes, there's competition. If there wasn't, it wouldn't be a challenge. I was young once. Mm hmm. <laughs> I was putting my oil in my car just this afternoon, charging my iPad, going a few miles up the road, get some ice for the cooler. And I had the hood up and I was, said California plates up here in Washington. And they said, some guy pulls up, rolls down his window, and he, old, about my age, a little older, and he goes, Excuse me, Miss California, are you in need of service? And I'm like, Do I look like I'm in need of service? Thank you, sir. Thank you, no. Oh, coming up without a mask. Don't be afterward. Anywho, let's wear masks, you guys. I want to go to Europe next spring. They're not letting us in. Okay, sorry for the chit-chat, but I was feeling like, what's going on? What's the secret? What's the secret that needs to be revealed? Jeez, there needs to... You have to have the strength to tell the truth and be authentic. No more playing games, my queen of cups. You're ready to look forward, look up, look up to the stars. I hold my cup high. I know who I am. I'm happy with or without him. That's a good affirmation. I'm happy with or without him. I got my own coin. I ain't taking no crumbs, no, no more seven of swords in and out. I'm reconsidering my options. And there the queen is again with the temperance card. We know how to turn fire, blend fire and water. There's that Knight of Cups wanting to, cut, wanting to offer something to that queen. He's been a bit of a devil. There's been conflict in the past. The ego. It was always you. It was always you. What did you mirror? What do you want to mirror now? Who are we now? Temperance. One foot in the real world, one foot in the spiritual world. And then voila, Mr. King of Cups shows, um, King of Pentacles shows up. Why did I say King of Cups? Oh, see? He's got his own stuff going on. He's looking over here. I got this stuff going on. But I'll offer you my cup because you're my empress. My queen of swords. My ace of cups. You're coming out. Shining. Out of heartbreak. Out of heartbreak, I have two empresses in this deck, two two of cups, and two lovers. We've been working hard, moving to, to get that soulmate, that offer. Will he make that offer? If we cut away what no longer serves us and we stand in our power and our integrity? Spirit guides and angels, this is just July, the second half. For Scorpio, what do we need to know about our soulmate and how they feel about us? Will they make that offer? The emperor, the divine couple. We each hold our own cup. Ace of Cups. Sorry about the quality, guys. Shh, gotta figure this thing out in the tent. We each hold our own cup. I'm happy with or without you. I feel fabulous, so I automatically track the perfect person into my life. That one you've been thinking about? Was it a king? A pentacles? My queen of cups? You want to get to that? You gotta manifest them walking in after being enlightened. They're moving forward. That you know how to use the alchemy now. It's being strong, knowing that we don't know the mystery of it all. 
thank God, do some research online, you know, quit spying on them, or they're spying on you, take it slow this time, you know there's competition, or it's not worthwhile, the first card out was justice, trust your gut, that is always your ace of cups, your third eye, the all-knowing, let's get a uh, energy oracle, it's kind of an esoteric one, my beautiful there, I'm going to putting out a couple of cards here, but let's let's see what is Spirit Guide's advice. We'll get the Energy Oracle going. Spe oh, bottom of the deck, Goddess of the Moon. Something about the Moon, the cycles, understanding your energy, freeing your heart right now, clearing it out for something new, letting go, asking the Angel of Love to bring you. Fourth, the fourth chakra, Archangel Raphael. Your heart, green and pink. Raphael, an angel of love, sends you this blessing. Let's see what else. Okay, how do we get to that? What do we have to release? Any blockages for my Queen of Cups, King of Cups, to come in? Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine. Mm. Second chakra, Archangel Ariel. So maybe some past wounds in your womb just needs to be healed. You don't need to buy a candle for $250. I used to do those expos and I'm like, you have to go. Can't. You just do a chakra balancing for your second chakra with orange, orange. Send you lots of orange, beautiful love, healing crystal light to heal your second chakra. And if you call on Archangel Ariel, she will clear that for you so that your cup will be healed. The Divine Feminine, the Holy Grail, my beautiful Queen of Cups. <laughs> Attraction is, and let's pass life. If you want to stick with me just for a minute, you guys, and thanks for liking, and sharing, and readings are only $24 for 24 minutes plus. I'll have Wi-Fi at the lake house day after tomorrow. But I could still do your reading. Let's book it. Mystic Wisdom Tarot at Gmail. Link below. What is the past life? that we're, Who is this person that's coming into our lives? How will we know them when we see them? What was our past life? What do we bring forward in this lifetime? Authority figures. A knight. Mm. You both have valor. And respect authority. Remember, justice came out first. Could be a Libra. But I feel that there's a past life here that's coming in when you don't even expect it, my beautiful Scorpios. Heal your, heal your cup and let go of any drama. You don't need it. Take it slow. Take it slow. It looks beautiful. I send you all my love and this soulmate. All you have to do is, yes, claim it. Be what you want, and they'll step in. I promise. Law of attraction. Ciao, Bella. Namaste. Thank you for subscribing and liking. Leave me a message. Love to you all. Look at my beautiful little place. I'm looking out into the forest. Isn't that amazing? Thanks, guys. Love and light. This guy I've had since I, I was a baby here. He wanted to come home too. My totem. Kachina. <laughs>